I am a new mom. Here we go. They are Clara and Charlotte. They're almost six months old and they are perfect in every way possible, of course. <laughs> I saw this weird bump on my wrist and I wasn't really sure what it was. The pathology reports came back that it was a giant cell tumor of the tendon sheath. I ended up having surgery in January of 2017 to have it removed. And then she went on and, and became pregnant with twins. Um, and after she became pregnant, the tumor grew back quickly. And unfortunately, the pathology came back with a very aggressive cancer. The cancer that Mallory had is something called an epithelioid sarcoma. It's a very, very rare tumor, and so um, for someone uh, in their 20s to have a sarcoma and need a major surgery is, is, is very rare. Yeah, it's, it's hard to put into words, you know? I think, I didn't think that my life would need saving at 27 years old, but it did. And fortunately, you know, here at, at the Institute for Limb Preservation at the Sarah Cannon Cancer Institute, we see a disproportional amount of these types of tumors because we treat these all the time. We got a call about Mallory and we got her in quickly to see us and establish our multidisciplinary care team. Dr. Lerman did a, I think they called it a surgical bed excision. So he went in and he took out everything that my tu the tumor was touching. Um, as much as he could without um, really sacrificing much function of my hand. Um, and then Dr. Schnur, he came in and sort of put me all back together. So he took um, a piece of my gracilis muscle from my thigh and put it in, um, on my wrist. And then they took a skin graft and put it on there too. So far she's doing great. Her function, I would say, is actually much better than I had anticipated it would be. Of course, you know, the function of the hand, and this is her dominant hand, uh, is essential for doing everyday things, the stuff we don't even think about, opening doors, um, getting glasses of water, keys in, in the car for those cars that still have keys. But then we had the, the added challenge, if you will, that she has brand new twins at home that she has to take care of. Um, so that we need to get her back as quickly as possible to taking care of those twins, enjoying her time with the twins, getting her back to, to life, and doing everything she needs to do as a mother. My hope for her is to return to her regular life, be a mom for her kids, and go on and see them grow up and not think about her wrist sarcoma on a regular basis. I cannot wait to watch my daughters grow up. And I am so excited to be a mom and to raise them and to go through all the triumphs and, and struggles of parenthood with their dad and I, I couldn't be more excited. <laughs>